uniqueness of acidiology and the ways it will assist the scientists in their research. Question. Oris, why do you believe in the reliability of obtained information? First, I was an inseparable part of it. Also, when I began to describe these states of consciousness, ranging from very simple ones all the way to very complex ones, while passing through thousands of these states of mind, this information has developed into one harmonious system, which, by its nature, is closely interconnected and very logically interlinked in all of its manifestations. This knowledge is currently reflected through 10 already published volumes, including the volume number 5, which was just completed. Currently, there are seven other volumes in publication. All the bits of information contained there are closely intercrossed and interdependent with any other bits of information, and there is not a single part of it which would not be coherent to the information pub published previously. This alone allows me to treat the obtained information as totally reliable. Second, the events, conscious participant of which I became during deep meditation, are described nowhere else, meaning that this information is not available in any conventional, scientific, or other sources. When referring to the genome, my description is directly linked to the facts discovered by the modern science now, revealing the core essence of this topic profoundly which allows the scientific community to answer all the questions related to this matter, and which currently possesses an insurmountable obstacle to scientists in general and geneticists in particular. The same applies to the provisions of physics. Acidiology provides the explanations in terms of space, time, holography, and their relationship. It describes in great detail the principles of their connection and correlation with one another, as well as the laws and principles of creation, the laws and principles of universal formation and the interactions of various universes together. I had no training in this field of knowledge. In fact, I am actually a winemaker and I have a great deal of interest in the subject. Frankly, I have graduated from the Crimean Agricultural Institute, but surprisingly even for myself, I got involved in this scientific predicament. Question. Do you have some kind of spiritual teacher or a spiritual essence who contacts you and transmits the information? I do not have anyone contact me whatsoever, as I contact only the various levels of my own self-consciousness. I immense into my own higher quality levels of self-consciousness, who exist on the different, more universal levels. Above these levels, there are more of an even higher quality levels of my own manifestation, my personal self-consciousness, so to speak, the collective unconsciousness, collective overconsciousness, collective superconsciousness, and so on. Depending on the type of question I wish to know the answer to, I simultaneously adapt to the system of perception of the certain levels of my own self-consciousness, who knows the answer to this question meaning that I synchronize with certain forms of my consciousness in order to derive any specific information. This form of consciousness can exist in completely different space-time continuums and completely different existential conditions, including formless ones way beyond any perception of forms that we are accustomed to. Actually, the forms always exist for sure. However, 
It has completely different energy informational parameters and composition. Question. Can you thus obtain any information pertaining to the future? Yes, I can. In the volume 15 of Is Ideology, I have partially described some of the variants of our possible nearest future, as well as the surroundings of my form in those worlds, along with the interactional and creative implementation activity types. However, I am more interested not in the form itself, but rather the entire range of interactions of that form, including the cause and effect relations. If I am to focus entirely on the forms existing throughout various worlds, I could write an exorbitant amount of books depicting an enthralling array of science fiction material, but that by itself will not provide much of a legitimate and truly important information. However, it is important for me to provide as much reliable and more substantive information to the scientists, psychologists, physicians, geneticists, physicists, and mathematicians in particular, while I still have the opportunity for it in the given group of space-time continuums and existential scenarios. For instance, in some of our possible nearest future scenarios, there exists a holographic mathematics. Can anyone provide any information as to the specifics of this field study? Also, in some variations of our future exists a science, called holographic genetics. Currently, very few scientists are just commencing to approach this subject of study on the basis of wave genetics, making a first, timid and shy step towards the f these future research fields. At the same time, Acidiology provides the kind of information which allows one to skip an exorbitant number of intermediate stages of development, allowing for the implementation of much more complex techniques and instruments.